Hello everyone, I'm Double J. Welcome to another itch.io find called Intruder. And it's a simple uh, synapse. It says you started working from home and bought a new house far from the city. But something seems off about it. Just be cautious and don't believe in fairy tales. So we'll hit the about button so we can get the information. A game made by Night Games. Here you go. All the stuff. Props to the props. Now. Are we going to be the intruder or are we going to have an intruder? You never know with these games. There could be a weird twist. Let's hit start. If you like the game, drop a like by the end. Ooh, we're going to have different checkpoints. Color me intrigued. 1802. After work. We oh, finally done with work. I'll go downstairs and eat something. Mm, my stomach's growling. Yes. Okay, can I interact with this? It said left mouse button to interact as I was getting up. Diary one three twenty twenty four. Finally bought a house. It was rather cheap. I'm very lucky. The realtor was also very nice. It's a bit far from the city, but this won't be a problem. You know, now I work from home. Not a bad view either. Not a bad view either. Holy cow, we got working lights. Well, one pair of working lights. We have working lights in one room of the house. No wonder why it was so cheap. That, that legitimately scared the crap out of me. That tree shadow looked like a jester clown peeking his head. All right, there we go. I had to change the sensitivity a little bit. Ah, there we go. Well, I was trying to get the TV remote, but we get in the drawers. Can we get in. Can we get in. You gonna legitimately get me stuck right here, Gabe? I'm trying to see if I can get up. I'm stuck. Oh, okay. I want to look into that, like move the bed over or something. Uh, being stuck by the ceiling lights. Just little, little nuts. All right, bathroom. Nothing crazy in here. What's in here? Another bedroom. Can't open any of the drawers or doors. Oh, we got a nice little patio set out there. They got a nice little side yard. Is there a door back here? Can't access it. All right, let's go downstairs and get something to eat. I'm bushed and I'm hungry. Pizza! Left hand is full. Yeah. <laughs> nom, 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 nom. Wow. We really were hungry. Uh, that, that's a, oh, okay. You said drop it in the trash can. I was like, man, we, we was hungry. We ate the, the whole thing in one go. Hello? Who are you? Yeah. Yes? What do you want? Hello. I heard that you moved into this house. Welcome to our neighborhood. Voice, even if it is AI. Yes, that's right. Thank you. I'm very happy that this house is occupied again. After the last owner went missing. Last owner went missing? Oh, you didn't know. He went missing after saying he kept hearing noises and weird things were happening inside the house. 
Is that so? He thought that the house was haunted or something. I'm sure he was just joking. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, welcome again. Here's a gift for you. Bye. Thanks. Bye. Ooh, flowers. Can we put them down or we just gotta fuck them? They're old, actually. All right, now it's time to go food shopping. Yeah, because we inhaled all the food in the house, I guess. So, are we walking? Do we have a garage? What's the dealio, Emilio? All right, I guess. Uh, no, we're not not taking the car. Well, it seems like a pretty nice night. Food shopping. <laughs> the twelve six, <laughs> but it's upside down. So this is nine twelve. Why? Why do I have garbage? Why did I just appear in the gar grocery store with garbage in my hand? That. What? I am so confuzzled. Do you want some garbage? I don't know where this came from. That was the weirdest thing ever. I knew something was hey going to be up you with got you. Some money. I'm hungry. There you go. <sighs> Thanks. You must be the new guy who moved into the haunted house, no? A haunted house. How'd you know that? This is a small town after all. But be careful and don't trust anyone. Also, don't believe in fairy tales. Okay, thanks. See you around. Lucky I wasn't strapped, man. Okay, I should get some milk and rice. Milk. Are you going to do what most games do and point me in the direction or I got to just kind of click? Wow. <laughs> Very 2D shelves. <laughs> okay. Well, these are the coolers. Am I, am I wrong? Maybe you want rice first. Oh. That seems different. Okay. So it was it was a 3D object in a 2D world. That's how we know what we're looking for. Gotcha. So where's the 3D milk in the 2D shelving? Is there 3D milk on the 2D? Where, oh, where is the... I didn't know. There. 3D milk in a 2D shelf. <laughs> uh, hey, it's a simple way to show you what you need to do without using arrows. I'm not hating on it. Don't don't mistake that as hating on it. I'm just laughing. Doesn't mean it's a bad idea. Because a lot of other games resort to just big old flashing arrows that appear out of nowhere. This was a, a simple but non-arrow in your face way of showing you what you need. Welcome. Let me know if you need anything. Uh. Welcome. Let me know if you need anything. I just. Oh, okay. You're done shopping? Yeah, that's all. Okay, then. You're new on this neighborhood, right? That's right. Bought a house. Ah, uh, I see. You bought that famous house. Just don't be scared if you hear or see things, haha. -ha. So I've been told. Here's your package. Come again. Will I? Or am I gonna die? Tonight, you. Tonight, you. 
Hey, buddy. A little Aqua Teen Hunger Force there. We have no idea what time it is. And we're in the forest for some reason. What is... What? Where am I? Good freaking question, sir. I mean, we're in the woods. Are we going deeper or are we getting out? Should we have gone that way? What do I see in the middle of the path up here? Is that a person? That is a person. Okay. Was that a death? Is that an ending? No. 343. Night. Could we have avoided that if we ran the other direction? Just a bad dream. Uh oh. What was that sound? I should go check it out. Yo, I got NRA membership in my pocket, a shotgun over the fireplace. <laughs> what the hell is this? Now you get the shovel from the garage. Can I get into the garage from out here? I certainly shouldn't be getting to it from the inside of the house. Got it. Okay, now I should try and hit it from behind. <laughs> Didn't know what every guy says. <laughs> I apologize. This is a scary game. We're supposed to be sneaky, sneaky. Clonk. It's probably Santa Claus, right? Hello? The police came and arrested the intruder. Turns out it was the general store owner. The neighbor and the realtor was also part of the scheme. They would make the house look like it's haunted to buy it for cheap price and then sell it back for a higher price to make profit. They were all arrested and moved back to the city. All right. Well, that was the most direct storyline you could have given me. No twists, no turns, just kind of... I mean, I suppose I could be considered a twist, but it's, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a, a trope now. Anyways, that wasn't bad. I mean, we got the good scare from that, that homeless dude. And then uh, the atmosphere is all right. I think I could play a longer version of this game if it was more intricately drawn out. But other than that, I was uh, it was all right. Tell me what you thought below in the comments and uh, leave a like if you enjoyed it. Otherwise, as always, hope you have a wonderful day. We'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.